December 10, 2021. We begin our assault on the capital of Etruria. This castle has many, many side objectives and a lot of enemies that will stand in our way to them. To that end, I repair the Manikati using the Hammer and Staff so that Lin can make use of that juicy triple effectiveness again. She immediately makes good use of it against the starting enemies. I have to intentionally hold her back a bit just so she doesn't kill a mage with a stealable gem. But I haven't forgotten how strong she is with a bow, even baiting enemies through walls just to destroy them ahead of schedule. Lin is so powerful in this chapter that her spirit manifests itself whenever Fa attacks. These glitchy dual strikes actually mess up the game. This is the only way that using Lin could ever cause a reset when playing Fire Emblem, the Binding Blade. Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to Fire Emblem 6, the Lindening Blade. We are in Chapter 16 still, haven't finished by a long stretch yet. Uh, we have some interesting side objectives to look forward to though, and as always, not doing it alone. What's up, Raisins? Doing well. Let's go. It's all good. It's all good. I'm looking, I'm looking forward to dealing with the reinforcements, dealing with the secret shop. Favorite things? And I'm curious. I'm curious what we're gonna buy. Do you have reinforcements? I love. I love reinforcements. I that's love. Why that's, why have me, <laughs> that's why I have. why. why I have you look at a market time. Oh yeah, true. <laughs> true. Um, so we just elaborately discussed for like four minutes what exactly what we're going to do, just to make sure we were up to speed. <laughs> like a, it was supposed to be just a test recording, but we ended up talking for like five minutes. Yeah, I know. We, we we talked so long. I was like, yeah. Kind of. I was. I was like, are we, are we actually recording? Do I need to like crack jokes? And, like, <laughs> Or Do you have to be entertaining or just knowledgeable? I know. Turns out you have to be both. Um, oh. So, the objectives, real quick. Uh, chests here, something I discovered. This chest is not in range of the Spalting Mage that the spawns from here in like two turns. We're on turn 10. I think it spawns on turn 11, right? Turn 12. Okay, whatever. For the mages, turn 12, apparently. So, uh, we don't have to worry about when we get these chests, we can just get them all right now with you. Uh, Douglas, we're gonna try to distract using Roy. We can't like, get Douglas on the tile here before the reinforcements appear, or are supposed to appear, but we can block the reinforcements and then kind of deal with that from there. Like, just put Roy on the, on the tile and have Douglas go for him repeatedly. Um, everyone else is gonna run past this bishop. The bishop can heal Douglas if he so desires. That keeps him alive for the rest of the chapter. Uh, then we have Astro over here who needs to steal from this manic heat, steal from Narshan. And then probably raid the chest over here, so we'll use the time he takes to get over there to kill these snipers, probably Lin and Lina. And we'll take care of these stairs with whatever is left over, so that'd be like Fa or, I don't know, maybe Cecilia can help a little bit, or maybe we'll put Lin a little closer to the stairs first. Uh, but right now it's turn 10, so we don't have to worry about the stairs yet, right? But first reinforcements are turn 11, I think you said. That's right, that's right. We still got a turn. Okay. So what I'm thinking of doing here then is we position Lin so that she takes on these snipers and then next turn we have to make sure that she can 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Actually what we can do, we have a Boots Dancer. So Ooh. I know I haven't said it before or anything, but we can use Lin like twice this turn to just kill one of the snipers. And the next turn she'll enemy phase another one, finish him off somehow, and then we're good to go. That is smart. I think the other one has a steel bow. 24 plus 17 is 41, so she like just barely survives the two attacks. You know what, I didn't do the math at all, but I'm glad you did. We could even attack with Lina, heal Lina. Uh, if, if Lin dodges the attack, we can... Uh, if she dodges the attack, we can dance her and kill the sniper this turn. If she doesn't dodge, we can heal her and then... Put Lina and then dance her and kill the sniper this yeah, turn. No. Something like it. Something like it. <laughs> we can take care of him this turn. That's for sure. Okay, she got hit. Yeah, we have 100% we have hit, so yeah. she can definitely do it. Okay, so we're going to have to heal her. Uh, we can, like, heal... What we can even do like mm. is attack with Lina as well, and then if, if we Lina heal from the right, hit, we can't we dance from the right. Here Ooh, we go. true, true. Heal her. Yeah, no, we can't dance from the right, but it, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Yeah, we can we can dance for uh, Cecilia if Lina gets hit though. Ooh, true, true. Although if uh, Lina attacks here, gets hit. If Lina gets attacked twice on enemy phase, then she might die. Yeah, she, she could suffer. Although, I think if we put the supports in range, because Lilina has a light support that does give plus defense. Yeah, but it's only so. plus one at A. Yeah, it won't it won't save Lona, but it will it will help Lin somewhat. So I guess if we just like keep them in support range. Yeah, so just kind of I think just end turn then, right? Cause if we attack there's a chance Lilina dies. We could attack if he misses, we just dance Lona and then kill him. Yeah, but what if he gets hit? Do we have a plan for that? I uh, would just walk Lilina away. Oh yeah. I like that. Because then Lin will still be in support range, survive two hits. I like that. That's Flexibility. Really <sighs> nice. Okay, these guys Ooh. are dead now. 
Now we just dance Lina and kill. Neat. Uh, let's Ooh. dance from below. I think that gives slight more options for the Mercs this next turn. So let's go. Dance here. from below. Reduces chance of misclick. That's you. <laughs> that's you. <laughs> Honestly, there are some scenarios where that's actually the right play to do. Is like make sure you dance from a spot where you can't make a mistake. Okay, I guess. You don't want to open the door this turn, obviously. Maybe just go and steal now first. Yeah, that's probably the best. Go and steal. If you're not arranged in the Yeah, yeah, I mean... At, at some point, Astor is going to have to, like, be... Oh, the Manicky doesn't move, of course. Right? I know, yeah, no, no, no. he does not move, as far as I know. Uh, let me take this opportunity to free up Astor's inventory a little bit, taking the red gem from him. He just needs the rest of the stuff, I think. Uh, he's going to steal the things, so, things, actually. Yeah. But whatever, we'll trade with someone else as well. We, uh, we could there. drop. We could drop an iron sword if we need to as well. Ugh, like, gross, dude! I'm not dropping anything. What a what a tragedy! We're not dropping anything. Okay. The get, rare discard item. Just five k. Oh, that's he got his own money back. <laughs> 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 okay, you got his own money back. Okay, so we need to like a few money now. Um, no one's gonna be in range of this armor knight, so we can do whatever we want with these units over here. Uh, Roy, I think it's gonna end up over. Or five. We could just put Roy on the tile, I think. I and think so. Alan, like, doesn't really need to be next to him, but, like, needs to stay in support range. That's mm -hmm. a good way to guarantee it. What Alan can do is Alan can go on Percival Square in order to, like, help wall against Douglas uh, yeah. from attacking by other people. Ah, uh, like that. Okay, so Percival's gonna, like, run away with probably Ellen or Gonzalez. Oh, he can't hold Gonzalez, so it's gonna be Ellen. Uh, yeah. I guess we might as well take this turn to heal one of my foot units here. As always, the lost cause, unrescuable. Yeah, he's so heavy. I think Shanna can rescue him, though, actually. Let's yeah. hmm. heal Rutger. Yeah, we can get going. Yeah, he can, just, he can just move. He can just move. I like the plan. We're just, you know, <laughs> leave Douglas from past him. Yeah. Run. Hopefully we don't get walled off by the bishop. That, that could maybe be an issue for later, but, you know. I mean... We'll, we'll, let, we'll let future us deal with it. Yes. I... I can't really see a scenario where that's going to hurt us, right? Because this turn he doesn't have anyone to heal, so he's probably just going to run at us. Mm. And there's no way Douglas can block Alan from reaching Roy ever. And at some point, we can make... We can force Douglas into certain squares. Okay, so that's he's true. just going to run away. Don't kill the bishop. He's, he's, he's our friend. Don't, don't hurt our friend. Uh, Percival... I guess pick up, picking up Alan will be okay, so she keeps up. Maybe yeah, we could do a take drop too with Melody. Uh, too late. <laughs> oh, <laughs> we could put Milady in the square to block instead and have Alan do the tick drop, and then he comes back That's running true. back later. Uh, that, that, that does leave him out of range of Roy, though, which I don't like, so just don't do it. Uh, do you murder him? So you're saying there's a chance. There's, there's no way he attacks Alan over Roy, right? Like, there's, there's, there's no, no way. way. There's, there's absolutely no way. no way. There is no way. Okay, just hold your killing edge give him like a javelin. Hold your or give him like a javelin so he super duper doesn't do it, you know? If I give him a javelin, it's more likely that he does it because he has a axe. He has a silver axe. Oh wait, D does he kill with a javelin? No. This is what I mean. I mean, that like he's he, he's super duper one attack Alan now. But if I have this, doesn't he have less of a status to attack Alan because I have open triangle and everything? Uh, you know, I don't really know. Like, I feel like if he would, if there is a chance that he attacks Alan, it's more likely with the javelin. Because True, but he, there's a 0% chance that he died to Alan with the javelin arm. Okay, we'll see what his preference is. Either way, he's not going to die. So we'll see what his preference right. is when he has his javelin. If we know, then we can just give him the clearing edge next turn. It Science doesn't really time. matter at that point. That's uh, true. Science time. Is Lynn good in Binding Blade? <laughs> Will Douglas attack Alan? We'll see. All right, goes for Roy. Turn of hypothesis. Turns out I was correct about something else. Exactly. About Lynn. Oh, no. At this rate, Douglas will die, guys. Okay, this is looking good, too. Fry this guy. Fryer. Put him in the air fryer. There we go. Is that what an air caliber is? Oh, he's not even. He's like, Douglas, you're not hurt enough to get health care. I'm sorry. That's right. <laughs> Staying where you are. Okay, so. I think you can just stay here, basically. Don't have to worry about anything. Except mm -hmm. just maybe. Try to make sure that the bishop can't stop Roy from running away, maybe. So, like, maybe. Roy here and then Alan on the square. Does that make sense in any universe? Uh... I think so. Honestly, if we just like keep 
Alan directly adjacent to Roy, then we'll always have an escape square. Yeah, we'll always have an escape square. Yeah, I just don't want it to be like Bishop here, Douglas here, and then we have to run rights or something, which is a little awkward. It's still possible though, and like we can always like have someone else come back here for them, so it's not the end of the world. I'm pretty sure. Wait, is Alan? If Alan's way down by Roy and has a javelin now, will he like double Douglas? Um. Well, his speed will get weighed down. He doesn't get weighed down with a javelin, right? So he has 15. Will be reduced to seven, I think, it rounds down. So no, Douglas is actually faster than Alan in that case. There we go. Some so we could rescue him. Yeah. Or just they're, like they're rescue the no away. Yeah. Ooh. Because like you don't need to do it now. You just do it. Yeah, later. yeah, yeah. Um, I'm, yeah, yeah, I like the turn running away. Because this way we're taking less damage. Okay. Um, well, everyone else is out of range, so everyone else did a good job of being out of range. Let's make sure we go here. What do Victory. you have again? Javelin. Okay. And the steel lance. It's a very steel I lance. Swap into the game. <laughs> Longbow can reach just like 10 damage though. Everyone reaches this guy. How very nice. How very convenient. Okay, we'll just we'll just give him the good old give him the good old fashioned this thing. Give him the good old 24 damage. Apparently some of the comments said my, my lady is actually like straight on, on average. Like she just has her average stats. Like exactly on average? I, I, I do remember. Blessed. I mean maybe not I like remember dead on. Was. True. I didn't keep track of the promotion level. And we did give her a lot of levels for promotion too. Yeah. We did, which is um, uh, okay. I actually more limited in what I have. I think I just, or rather, I'm more limited in the amount of um, lance reavers I have than killing edges. So I'm using like killing edge. You know, it's kind of. Yeah, dumb. I know. At this point, killing edge is just like the regular weapon, mm -hmm. and I think we're gonna get a like next chapter. We're just gonna get a shop that sells killing edges, and we have a silver card. Oh, really? I didn't know that. Uh, That's true. Whoever wants healing, it's right here for you. Uh, I don't think I grant as much to do anymore, honestly. Same for Gonzalez, but I just don't want it to be on this party. Yeah, there's, there'll be the reinforcements from the right, but like, or from the bottom center, but yeah. But right. from here, you mean? I well, they could fight those. Or we can leave the throne room to them and just have Lin and Lin take care of them. Lin I do love... <laughs> I was just thinking the Lin Durandal animation. I'm so glad. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Is it Ember Storm here, the hack? So glad they put that in. Yeah, I know, right? Uh, I, I already told Braces this, but I talked to Ember Storm about... Ooh, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna fry that mm -hmm. guy real quick. Uh, we'll, we'll, I'll save that thought for after I've taken this red gem. I know. I saw the one shot. I'm like, oh, that looks <laughs> nice. I totally forgot that red gem existed. I would have fallen for it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Goodbye. Get fried. Whoa. Wow. Nice mannequin. It's very threatening. Kill fire with fire. With 420 blazes. <laughs> yeah. Imagine having 420 might. Okay. That, that was true. Fine. Why are they weak to four blaze? That's stupid. Oh, more magic. Unexpected. It's the, um, what's it called? The, not, not the divine fire. Not the sacred fire. The infernal fire. Mm, truth. What's it called? The infernal truth. That's what? why. Maybe dragons just, like, can't handle the truth. They're, they're living in a false reality. <laughs> like, they're, they're actually just in the matrix are, right are now. Saying it doesn't make them, sense. Are you saying we're hitting them with facts and logic? But, yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's what we're doing. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five attacks here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, what if I pick up Lina with Lin, dance her, and move her back down so that she's in range of the left mark? A. Ooh. And we can we can have some more glitchy fa, I guess, but. Okay, I'm gonna do glitchy fa one more time and I'm gonna turn it off because the setting is gonna get old real fast. Because it's oh, yeah, two mercenaries, right? They can't really do a whole lot. I don't think. Actually, a little skeptical, but we'll see. Uh, one, two, three, four. I think this is a good square. Okay, so Lin. Go up here. Pick up your friend. She's our brute stancer. Yep. We did use her last turn, though, to be fair. Yeah. <laughs> she's only in this position because she's had boots so for so many turns, am I right? Yeah. Okay, and I did heal Lin, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I did. Okay, so just don't even need to like re equip or whatever. I'll set up a nice face dual strike. <laughs> yeah. I think honestly the issue with the brute stancer and why we haven't gotten much use out of it is because we keep on like sending Lala with people who have six move, five move, so yeah. she actually just can't make use of it. Because she has to move at their speed. That is sometimes an issue. Oh a mage, I didn't know that. I thought it would be a mark from there. Nah. Uh, two shots, damn! Look at that! Are you doubling does two? She double though? The fuck dude. Oh what oh. the hell, bro? She's finally doubling. Finally, Lina's good in the Binding Blade. All right, there's one con. Oh, it's a fighter from there. I thought you said it. I'm getting all the wrong oh. reinforcements. Can I get oh, different ones? Oh, it was um. 
I, I, I should have been more clear. Yeah, there's uh, two of the reinforcements are mercs, because like there's four reinforcements, one of them we block in. Two of them are mercs, and then that one's a fighter, and then there's a mage from the left. Honestly, it's on me too. I thought it would be a merc. Well, hope you don't get doubled, I guess. Oh, it's a steel axe. There's no way he does enough speed to double. All right, let's go. There's no way. Use the dual strike he, to he, kill him. He, he, he <gasps> the met. sneeze! Oh. The sneeze! No. That's cute. Something to sneeze at. Okay. Is it going to glitch out the game when she won rounds? When she crits, I don't know. Ooh, stick level up. We're about to find out. No defense. Oh, yep, yep. That definitely fucked up the game. <laughs> yep. That definitely fucked things up. I wonder what happens, minute. Yo, I wonder what happens if we uh, glitch out the game and then get the bishop to heal somebody. <laughs> God. This is turning Douglas into infinity HP. <laughs> this is turning into something else real fast. Okay, I can have Lena heal for better again. Yeah, we better reset and resume before oh, anything I, silly happens. I guess so. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna turn fast animations off now. That was like that's peak fast animation. Can't make it any better than that. All right, it was fun. Fun. It was. It was fun. It was no wait, it was no, wait, 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 wait. Here we go. Okay, all good now. Okay, there we go. Turn her anime off. <laughs> yes, no anime. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, would you look at that? Boots dancers coming in clutch again every time, dude. Every time, mm -hmm. I swear to God. All right, let's use a hand axe and fe six to give her this guy. Or come from close. Gonzalez, no less. <laughs> yeah, Gonzalez hitting people with the hand axe. What year is it? <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't know if we can like kill this turn or not. I'm just gonna have seven, eight. Okay, I'm gonna use that grind to kill this one. Let's use your iron bow. She has only good weapons. <laughs> yeah, that's a big, uh, a big drawback of having so many good weapons. You only fill your inventory so much. So what we can do is like come in here. Well, we don't even want to kill him because we want to steal twice. So I guess we like true. go in here. Dance for him and steal one thing and then rescue drop him out a little bit with my uh, Thanks, talents. Sam. So do that. Uh, over here, dance. This also gives us, gives us an opportunity to sell things too, because I think we have like what two red gems and a blue gem. Something like it. Oh, it's gonna be. First of all, it's a spare slot we can use. So take a Delphi shield first. Very important item from a lady. She could just take oh, it right true. now. She doesn't need anything else anyway. Take the Delphi shield. I just don't Kanto glitch. Oh, uh, I mean, we're good. We, we're we good. Trade it. Like you, we should be good. Yeah. I mean, we trade it. We won't I've seen Kanto glitch when it didn't like do the thing. Uh, is Rusk gonna have a good weapon for Narshin? I used a Drandal on him actually, so that could work. That'll do. Yeah. Uh, you can't take drop those, so it's gonna have to be take drop. And okay, probably not need it here. Probably gonna have Percival take care of these mages before anyone mm -hmm. else needs to. Is there a heal target for Ellen? Maybe Melody. Yeah, I think she's still at half, and then. I think I healed both Iger and Rutgers, so that's no longer an issue. Yeah, that's gonna have to be it for her. I guess yeah. Melody can like distract the mage, like move him down a bit, but we wanna go up the corridor anyway, so once we just see the points. You said there was nothing coming from here, right? Ever. Yeah, nothing nothing comes from there ever. It's, it's a fake stairway. Maybe like a unit in a cutscene comes from there? I have no idea. Possibly. Like, maybe Gale does. Oh, maybe, maybe. I, I think Gale actually just comes in from the top left. Oh, yeah, I think so, too. He's like, he was, he was checking out the secret shop. Oh, we gotta get fire out of there, though. Yeah, I think I should put her one closer, in hindsight. Do this, though. No, oh, I like how she stays in normal good. form. Like this. Aww. I didn't know that. Okay, come one closer, so that next turn, even if you don't kill the fighter that comes out, you can still, you know, win. Like, get the tile and heal yourself. That's true. Oh, they don't true. have a phone, but I can take care of that too. Okay, you go over here. Lena range. We still have Lena, yeah. Honestly, we can block off either one if we want. Yeah, but like clips. <laughs> true, true. It's like the shaman. You gotta clips. get eclipse. Oh, stop it! <laughs> I like that. Uh, okay, so you're just fast enough to not get double by this maze, so might as well. It's gonna oh, be two though. Like, yeah, yeah. there's gonna be one reinforcement, but they cannot both attack her though. Like. Can they roll high? There's, there's one thing about Cecilia, you know, she's, she's not gonna kill an enemy, suffer from success. Um, I mean, even if they do, she doesn't get one out of the two. She has a lot of res. She has a lot of res. She's yeah. res is good. Okay, so go here, get this chest. Brave Lance. Let's go. Ah, that's a good weapon. I like that. Just like the convoy. Oh, what if Mernin's is full again? Ooh. I, mean, I did tell you I had like 20 spots free, right? So it should be full. I think so. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's it. This is, this is all we got. Okay, enter. Oh, there's the bolting mage, there's the mages, fighter, fi everyone is present. 
The gang's all here. She's dodging and doubling. Like this is it doesn't get this is Peak Lin. Oh wait. Oh I, I equipped a did a different weapon now, I think. I don't know. Did yeah, I? The American might have rolled oh, more too. speed? <laughs> more speed? Let's go. One speed? Hey, more speed? And what? And what? Good stat? Yep. Should probably turn Roy off as well. Although it's it's funny to see him stab Douglas like this. <laughs> 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 you must not kill Douglas, everyone. At some point his iron sword is gonna break. Oh right, he's he's top to move order too. Yeah. That'd be funny if Roy just like equips the rapier after and <laughs> starts like murdering Douglas in one round. Just like thrashing him 18 might. Oh, hand axe. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. You okay, ooh. Fan? That's uh, that's close. It's hefty damage. Okay, actually, with both enemies being alive, that's a little bit annoying. Because Fa doesn't have a way to heal herself other than Lina's elixir. Just focus on uh. If we kill the fighter, I think we're pretty safe. I think so too, because the Merc can't even reach her if she's on that tile. Oh, true, true. So, we can just like put it in the range of both marks again. She just doesn't, she doesn't die anyway in like two rounds. So we can like use the killing edge against this guy. Mm -hmm. While still being in the Lina range. Easy dodge. Fifty six crit. Goddamn. I that remember. Is no, no plus thirty crit, but yeah. What do you remember? Yeah, I remember early on, people were a little worried because I was giving other units supports, and they thought Lin would go supportless. Because no. in the early game she has no supports, because you know, Boris supportless is very good. Uh, but turns out when she gets one, it's actually still decent enough. Okay, see, so yeah, I don't reach the Merc, perfect. So just go here and chill. Um, there we go. I think she leveled defense last level too, so oh, yeah. we got saved. Ooh, nice 69. Okay, steal again. Oof. Get the blue gem. Get the star sphere, right? Who said that? Okay, we need some chip so we can get some chip. Uh, by the way, something I need to check real quick. The rune sword is usually magical. Like in FE7, I know it always hits on magic. It's the double different from light brand. Uh, but it's basically not strategy sword on that. Some people think it hits on res, some people think it hits on defense. So let's 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 science check that real quick, alright? So, I'm almost dead certain it hits on defense. Me too, me too. So it ha he has 32 attack, so if he hit on defense, he would do 22 to Rutger. But if he hit on res, right. he would do seven more. So mm -hmm. that'd be like 29. Yeah, something like that. So let's see how much it is. It's 22. So myth busted. How much damage does it do from range? Uh, we'll never know. I don't have the light brand on oh. me. We can check out what about my green? Yeah. Uh, yeah. My has one more defense than uh, Rutger. And she takes 21. So wow, just does full damage at range too. Yep. Um... <laughs> Our bad. <laughs> no. 53% to hit. I don't think I will, thank you. Well, let's see how Agran does, I guess. He might heal yeah, up, but sure. then, like, even if we do like damage to him and he heals from us, uh, we still kill with Rutger and Drano, I think. Also, Narcissus she, she might Ooh. Beautiful. Me, and no one else! And Ooh, Ooh, let's go. Mm -hmm. Actually, I think he might heal too oh. much. Yeah, we just... Yeah, yeah. We, just, yeah. we just gave him wow. free HP. <laughs> Well, well done, us. <laughs> I mean, it's okay. We still have our boots to answer to make up for our failures. We just gotta sure. hit him with Rutger and hit him again with Rutger or something. If we rescue, uh, well, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, we can like rescue. I'm sure we have ways. I think we like rescue uh, and then get what's his face in here. We can like or rescue. We can attack twice yeah. with Rutger, for example. Oh, true, true. Let's go, Rutger. Or crit him once. Yeah, always an option, but not for Rutger. Not for this Rutger. He doesn't, he doesn't no, really care no. for that whole critting thing. Alright, got chip damage with the Durandal. I finished him off with an iron sword. <laughs> Let's see. I don't. I think he has the L sword with him, but it's still viable. Unless we miss, of course. But fortunately, he's on a throne, but he's not like. He doesn't get bonuses what? from it. I think we do enough damage. I think oh, we're gonna have to go for another Durandal shot here. Although it would I be, so, yeah. it would be more fitting to kill off the blade, don't you think? With the set with a seven seven six. <laughs> Wait, we have oh we have the seven seven six. Okay, that's important. That's important. I mean, we, we always have Rutger. You're my lady. You're my lady. Ha! Ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> you betray, you betray your, home your home and join the enemy. You are a disgrace. You're a disgrace. <laughs> my loyalty lies with the chancellor. <laughs> I am. <laughs> I am. <laughs> no, no, I am the Senate. You have lost. <laughs> Goodbye. See you. And Melody level to four. Oh my god, I'm so bad. 
I'm, I'm easy, signing off. Easy. There we go. Let's see, we'll get level up. It looked like our level four level up. I, I won't blame you for that one. That's true. Was Tony mode. That was pretty good. Okay, yeah, we were holding Astor. Probably not a great idea. Let's let's get Astor over there. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, let's just give him to Percival next turn. Get him over mm -hmm. there. Or, you know, Percival could make up for his misses last episode by going over here instead. Let's do that. It's true. For the javelin, for more accuracy. Yes, <laughs> for more accuracy. <laughs> Subtle. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here. So we can put Cecilia here. On the light blue tiles. One, two, three, four, five, six. I miscalculated though. Oh, really? <laughs> it's okay. We have Milady to. I don't know. <laughs> we have to. We, we can get them over there. Yeah, okay. Ooh, what if uh, Rucker goes and takes? Well, Rucker Rucker doesn't, take, no. Too, he's too thin. He's too thin. I have to go with this. He's been on that. He's been on that plant-based diet. <laughs> Doing that little he's lost some weight. We can gift to Milady, and then Milady has two more move than Gonzalez, so you can gift to uh, Cecilia. There we go. That's maths. That's maths. Uh, does Rucker have anything to do? Not really. Oh. I guess be on the lookout, lookout here for reinforcements. Kind right. of have the chapter taken care of, really. Yeah. Kind of? Um, kind of? We yeah. have the bottom. It's still kind of sus, but you know. Yeah, but like, we're still covering that tile. I, I could just like always go back to that good old chest taking compilation, but you know what? We're still here anyway. Uh, that's true. Let's that's turn true. off voice animations for Douglas. Uh, here you go. Okay, not much should happen here. Oh, more accuracy tiles for Percival. Ooh. <laughs> Attacking Lena. Interesting career choice. Goodbye. Oh, that's true. Fire with a 100% hit. So what I love about Lena here is that the sheer accuracy is insane, especially at range. Not many units in this game have that. I don't think Lena's oh, yeah, good, no. but I think at this point Lena's good. I'm not gonna say Lola are good, but <laughs> but this Lola, epic. Mm, mm. I wonder when he's gonna get healed. I don't know. Also, wonder how many of these person will kill. What do you think? I think he's not gonna kill. He's not. Gonna, he's gonna miss this guy. Yeah, he's gonna miss him. Okay. Is he gonna oh, miss the next mind. one? I. You know what? I, I believe in the boy. All three. He's all, gonna three? Get all three. Okay, he's gonna miss all this three. one though. No. I believe him. Cecilia. Cecilia set up a kill for him, like, perfectly, and he's gonna mm -hmm. whiff, watch. Oh my god, you have more faith than no. me. I'm telling you. What a this mage third, killer. This third one, too? Mm -mm. What a mage killer. Whoop! He's dodge. Do like the remember, mage mist. Do you remember his affinity? Isn't it dark? Ah, uh, yeah, it's dark, for sure. Uh, that gives him hit, so... If we're getting treasures, we might as well like, put him next to Cecilia, and then Ooh. Get, like, get him a nice bunch of hit. She needs to grab these over here. Uh, it's true. We need gonna, to like, break down the wall too. Yeah. Let's, let's do this first though. Uh, give staff. Seems good to me. Yeah. Who's um going for the what's it called secret shop? That's a good question. We still have Hugh with a member card. Yeah. We also have. <laughs> we also have. I mean, we need to buy a hero quest for Deke, I guess technically, but we don't really. I don't know if we discussed it last time, but I'm not really super sure we need to like do that anymore. Because yeah, do we? One, two, three, four, five, mm -hmm. one. We can go here. You could just steal the one from Zephyr, you know? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I've done it before. One, two, three, four, five, one. The lingo's here. Sorry, Luna, I enjoy your images and everything, but healing is boring. <laughs> yeah, no. We. Just trying to make sure that she's not in range of the Merc because her HP's getting low. That's true. A wise move. What was I saying? Uh, yeah, I'm not. I'm barely feeling like Deke ever. Just double checking this. Okay, good. Chest here. Recover. Uh, the other question is like, whoever goes here to like get the member card from you is <laughs> to like get merch. Yeah, no. We can't. Can we? Can't we buy like robes from that shop though? That could be yeah, fun. Yeah, we can buy jelly robes. Mm, that'd be interesting. Do it for Lolan. <laughs> Like five robes on Lynn. He's like, ah, Lynn is gonna buy him like let's just six HP. Told you. <laughs> yeah, I know. I mean, I, I did answer a couple questions in the comments, like why aren't you using stat boosters here or there? I, I think we kind of agreed not to do that. So like give give the true accurate representation. Yeah. Very accurate that turned out to be. <laughs> <laughs> what with like a million res. Yeah. Hey, res growth isn't even that good, right? It's like twenty. I actually discussed this with my Patreon channel a while back. It's like I didn't really give Lin anything favoritism besides like maybe a bit more levels than your average unit, but either was so much XP that we effectively lost. Calm down, Roy. With so much XP that we effectively lost in the early game.
by trading Wade and Deke, for example, that I really don't oh, feel yeah, like we yeah. favored Lin much at all. Like, we just kind of used her as a combat unit, and that's about it. Uh, you actually don't have a Javelin on you. First of all, come back here. Got There's going to be, here. I think, one more mage, and then that'll be it for reinforcements in the entire map. Good. I can... You have a... Wait, is it actually? Is it turn 15? Yes. Yeah, okay. I, in terms of Javelins, I have no Javelins. This mage that's about to spawn will be the last mage. No, I'm gonna miss them. Okay, I just want to build supports. Okay, don't be, don't be silly. Oh yeah, let me stop do that one. Ooh. Let's spam some stabs. Actually, that's not. It's a silly thing to do. Okay, let's. So see. Get the, let us not use a staff. Um, so we to treasury here. Is that in range? Uh, what? Is that in range of a merc? I can't count. Oh, no. One, two, three, four, five, one. It's not. It's okay. barely not. Here, half health, whatever. I guess dancing might be useful over here. Do you rank stabs, Alona? Uh, possibly. She's gonna get it at some point. Nah, maybe she's not. <laughs> maybe she's not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe I thought it was not turn her staff rank. It's a silly thing. Mm -hmm. Is it possible for? I mean, Douglas is gonna be distracted by Roy like all all day long. So if we move up Rucker and just like surround him. Yeah. It's around Douglas. I'm, I'm thinking of how to get Hugh out of there. Oh, uh, you just have to be the one carrying the member card, right? It can't be anyone. So True, true. It could be Percival. It could be the lady. Percival can go grab it and come back. True. Yeah. We make a giant ass chain of units. Like, well, yeah, we can, we can cover this. The world's largest trade chain. Yes. 51% crit, my goodness. Yeah, I think I think we outplayed this map a little bit too hard. <laughs> the map can't really beat us anymore. <laughs> yeah, no. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Okay, is, is he killing this one too? Is he going to go four for four on these mages? No, he's not. Oh, dude, trash. he's so inaccurate, dude. He's trash. He's awful. Yeah, he's you know, bottom, bot, dude, bottom he, he's tier. He's gonna miss it. He's gonna miss the mage now because he missed the mage. Bottom tier. Awful unit, bro. Awful unit. Go get him. Oh, god, missed again. Bro, this guy is not good. So yes, this guy's issues. So many issues. So many Most, issues. Actually, just one issue. It's just accuracy. But like, that's that's the issue. <laughs> if you if you don't hit, I'm just saying. I mean, zero damage is zero damage. Nice level up, Laura. Very cool. Go get him. Okay, we got him. We finally got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. I mean, there is Humility. potential for our sword rank here. <laughs> Armor Slayer Melody, let's go. I mean, oh, this it, is what it's Percival wanted all along. What a bro. What a oh, bro. With sword rank? What a bro, yeah. I wanted to give him sword rank to Melody. That's true, that's true. He was just thinking ahead, you know. Are we done with reinforcements? Like, are we officially done with reinforcements? Uh, we are officially done with reinforcements. The enemies on the map are the final enemies on, on the map. I don't know how else to put it. <laughs> okay. How about. Did we trade his swords off? Uh, what? Roy, his swords. Can we trade them away? Well, we could, but only to a unit that has swords too, I guess. Mm. Uh, technically, yeah, we could make it so that he... But he can get hit, and once Roy gets hit, it gets kind of dicey. True, true. It's like... He gets like two shot, and then that's a fall of us. What so. we could do is, um, Roy three squares down. What, like here, and I just keep mm -hmm. him away. And then... And then Allen North, what we can do is Roy three squares down and then Allen northeast of that square. And that'll do two things. It'll wall off the bottom so we can move up Allen behind if we need to for healing in oh, case yeah. we need it. And it also still allows us to travel through that corridor. Here's another proposal. Uh, we get the treasure real quick to show off what it is and then we cut to when we get to the secret shop. Okay, true, true. <laughs> okay, let's see what we got here. So we have Berserk Staff. Oh, that's I forgot you get that here. That's super good, actually. I don't have lockpicks left. You do. Okay, great. Pass it on, Douglas. Good shit. Uh, Busting down this wall was always like a bit weird, but you know. Yeah. Oh, we got to so make sure that you don't like break it and then let these super duper die on melody or something. Sword rank. <laughs> oh, sword rank. True, true. <laughs> you do build rank. I mean, he's gonna attack us, but like whatever. It's 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 these with a javelin against melody. What's the worst that could happen? There was an attempt. How much is he, do? is he doing? Oh, I can't check. I don't have a javelin. There's no way for us to know ever. Yeah, no. <laughs> There's like six. 
It's like six or eight, eight. Something like it. Sword rank. Just All right. don't take the ball. We got, we got treasury. It. Knight's Crest. Knight's Crest. Do we sell? I, I guess at some point we sell. Do we get like a huge deployment slot next shop? Uh, use them on us. They could just they give a bunch of people like gems and go from there. We could just deploy Merlin us too. Yeah, that's a good idea actually. I mean, we're going to Ilya. Is there a shop right away in there? Rob, yeah, there's a shop like literally right there. Hero Crest. Wait, we don't have to buy. All one. right, do we oh, sell? We do we sell this one right now for Angelic Crow money? Like, I'm actually thinking we might need to like put away the Iron Sword and Killing Edge for yeah. Angelic Crow money. If we want. Probably should done with the Night Crest. <laughs> Yeah, uh, <laughs> you put it away so quickly. I was like, oh. I and mean, the thing is, if we the want to sell one. things, we could just do it in the layout, right? Because we're right at the shop right away. True, but we can't buy angelic robes for that money. Oh, that's true. I mean, who even wants a robe at this point? Everyone is so. I feel like everyone is so tanky at this point. Yeah, no. Like, maybe Lelina would? I have no idea. Silver Blow. What else would we want from promotion items? Is is there actually actually anyone in our army who we like really want to promote? Give a bunch of the two to learn. Lars gives that. Let's go. I want to sell that for sure. Uh, could probably get Z's right now. Oh yeah, probably a good idea. Oh well, the other way. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> I will side with the javelin, right? Yeah, I, I would hope so. <laughs> right. I would hope right? so. Let's see what he does. I, I also hope okay. Douglas will get healed by eventually by his bishop. <laughs> eventually, yeah. Please, come on, dude. <laughs> Okay. I don't think it's happening. Sisterly squirrel. Sword rank? <laughs> 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 I was like, what did... Okay, what up? Okay, it's we sister. got Zeus. Oh. No brother. It's Zeus. Oh, we actually have Unilasses left. Wow. Yay. Oh, no. Good shit. Uh, so, I talked about this in Unisteel a while ago, but Zeus is a very memorable character for me in FE6 because I, I recruited him very early, so his character deployment orders were swapped around. And mm -hmm. Zeus joined in chapter 2 or so, and his accuracy was downright garbage because the 13 skill he has here looks really good, but this was him leveled down a little bit and he didn't have the harbor bonus that he does. I think he has literally 9 or 10 levels of harbor bonuses, it's an insane amount, so he gets a huge amount of strength and then some like of the rest of stuff, like a little bit of defense and everything else, like 1 or 2 points I think. Uh, but his skill is not that good at the level he joined at, so he was missing all the time to the point where it, it missing itself became a huge meme. And that was really mm. enjoyable and also really frustrating. Uh, Vanilla, I actually haven't used these all that much. I like that he's sort of trainable, but not as super weak of a start as like Lina or Nino or uh, Est from Fire Emblem, any <laughs> game that she's in. Uh, he's just yeah. kind of like goodish at base, but still obviously has some work to do. Uh, the main things he suffers from at base are low speed, so he doesn't double a whole lot, and low luck, I guess, and low res, I guess, but more importantly, uh, the rank classes. I think this is really bad for him. Uh, you saw how much we've been using killer weapons because they're so good and they're C rank, so the fact that he can't use those is a huge disadvantage for using him compared to other units that you have at this point. Because, first of all, they're really accurate, whereas iron... I think, I think we showed that killer is more accurate than iron by like 5 points, and in addition, it's also stronger. So if, if Zeus wants to have more might, he needs to use Steel, which is god awful. He's like 55 hit with it. Yeah, I know. And everything. It's it's frustrating as hell. And you also don't get extra weapon XP in this game from attacking with a Steel or anything. So his Lance Rank rises a bit slowly until you promote him. And there's the other dilemma with him, I feel like, where you want to take advantage of low XP gain to get a bunch of good levels in. Uh, he's going to cap his strength, sure, but you want to get some speed, maybe, or some defense. Uh, but... By keeping on promoted, you're probably delaying him hitting sea lances. So he's going to take advantage of that, that boost to his promotion for a shorter time because you're, you're forced to deal with the seven move seas with the lesser stats for a big portion of the game. So it's a bit of a difficult trade off, I think. Uh, so even though he and Heath are like very similar in a lot of ways, that are both wyverns that joins an enemy a bit on a level, they're like level seven exactly, uh, I think Felix like is a very different unit, and for that reason, not as good. Uh, particularly because of the speed and the lack of lance rank. Uh, but still a very serviceable unit if you do train him. Uh, I do like him once he's been trained. And the Wyvern class general is super busted. Uh, a bulky flyer. Uh, he also has like really good uh, aid compared to Milady because he is, he's a male. So he can rescue more people. True, true. He's never going to rescue Gonzalez or anything, but everything below that, uh, everything in the weight class is below that, he'll be able to pick up. And, and he, will, he will lose 2 weight two on promotion. Yeah, because he gets two con, right? But I guess that, that still comes with the, the advantage of not losing speed from javelins anymore, so I can't even complain about that. Um, that's my impression of Zeus. What about you? So, um, uh, Mecca, I got, I, I got a question for you. Uh-huh. 
uh, why don't train Zs? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we're kind of done training other units, so if I have to slots for him, maybe we can we can we can, like, we can just bench out six. <laughs> we can just bench out green. <laughs> True. <laughs> bench out green by a um a whip. Support him Do with the We have to buy a whip. I I think so because we failed to get um we sold Tate's a whip. whip right oh right we, we sold a whip. whip we missed a whip we get three total then right and you we sold yeah. one we missed another yeah we might have to buy one for him it's okay we got silver card and member card we can mm. do it yeah, okay I'm, I'm down for the challenge I mean nice doesn't work and always train <laughs> Shanna to level ten and promote her there we go I was like you know I could I could talk about Z's where it's like we could just show it off yeah I'm I will I will consider it it is nice to have a training okay. project online and like. Once Lina became competent, we started using Gonzalez, and then once we Gonzalez became competent, we resumed training Lin for like the fifth time. Yeah. So I, know. I guess it's nice to have another. Yeah, I, I, I see why not, especially with Fab being glitched. I guess this, this, this oh, yeah. is the most fun unit we have that can train up, right? I mean, besides oh, yeah. forty speed U or forty magic U. Yeah, no, we're not training them. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right, fair enough. All right, we'll go with it. Is that your analysis? Let's train. Let's uh, sure. I think like in general. I've used these a couple times on normal mode and on hard mode, to be honest with you. And you're 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 pretty much right. Accuracy is the main issue. Speed is kind of another issue. You can sort of fix both of them by just using iron lances and slim lances. I mean, like, look, this guy's got 19 strength. He'll he'll do damage with an iron or something. So he'll he'll be fine. He'll be, there's plenty of things he can damage if if you just find him. Also, yeah, the whole no killer lance rank is you know kind of garbage. But he's only three levels away from promo, and like the the enemies around you are level 15, 16, whatnot, so you're gonna get XP very quickly. You'll get the promotion in like six kills. Yeah, but that's if you want to promote him at ten. Which I mean, I guess that might be the most optimal way to use him overall. But I haven't experimented with that a whole lot. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Once he gets to level ten, of course, you have the option to promote. Oh, yes. He gets to, of course. He gets to. You get right. to promote. Uh, I'm gonna unite uh, the units that have expensive items as well as the member card in this upper left portion real quick to show off the secret shop, and that will probably be done. So, be right back. Yeah, be right back. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Dude, no, say, gonna fucking too. die, <laughs> bro. Oh, now he's really gonna die. Um, oh, there you go. Never there mind. Go. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was close. That <laughs> keeping that part. Okay, he actually broke his iron sword. Damn, but dedication. Um. <laughs> He has the light brand now. We're actually gonna do the thing he said and trade away his things. Uh, have yeah. a Jaffa. Roy, Roy just... Roy. There you go. Here you go. Now Roy he's like one two record. range. Yeah. Now Roy has one two range. There we go. Finally good yeah, unit. Yeah. Right? Finally good unit. And we can keep it because nah, we're probably like really rich right now. Oh. Oof. Did you just hit oh. Um. Oh, this is a uh, dangerous. Uh, moderately so. Yes, actually. <laughs> he can still fall. I guess we can kill the bishop, and then just. Uh, yeah, we're at no risk of killing Douglas anymore, so... Yeah, let's give her the bishop. Alright, Milady's ready to go shopping. We, don't, we all know Milady loves that shopping. Let's let's go see what's up in here. That's true. So, we can sell these for sure. We have another red gem somewhere, don't we? Whoa, uh, that's yeah, we card. have. Yeah, we should have one. And that's the promotion item, so if you... I mean, this is a game that we've discussed many times. This is a game where a lot of units don't have the promotion. They have, there's just not enough promotion items for everyone, especially if you're using like a bunch mm -hmm. of hero crest users like us. So this is where you can get an extra hero crest or ice bolt or whip, whatever you need. Or a robe. Robes are nice. So we can get a couple of sure, things. I, I almost always buy at least one promotion item here. So. Yeah. I mean, we, we got a hero crest from the chest, so we don't have to buy that. We do want to buy a whip for Z still if we want to use him. So I guess we're getting that. For sure. And then like... We could probably some... we have some gems left, some expensive stuff we can sell, so we don't need to worry about running out of cash right now. Yeah, we might as well sell it too then, or sell the gems. Yeah. Or oh, we were we we're the haircuts. Isn't there? I think there's another red gem on us somewhere. Yeah. I can't remember. I think I'll just buy two robes because like I don't even have that many targets for robes, but I do want to load up on killer weapons next chapter if we have the option. There's like clean mm -hmm. up weapons completely next chapter. Do a bit of a convoy maintenance. Yeah, who, who would use the rogue? It would be probably Lolan as one of them, right? Yeah, if we can have a Lina that actually survives a bunch of enemies on enemy phase, that could be really good in Ilya, which just takes down a bunch of uh, Pegasus Knights. But like, yeah. Cecilia like doesn't really need to fight very much, there's no point. We can like make Z's super bulky before training him, I guess, but it doesn't really solve his offense problem. And then, like, he's also like 24 away from capping. I, I, doesn't he have like an 80% growth as well? Yeah, he's he's pretty tiny. He has an 80%, yeah. he has an 80 HP growth. He'll, 
probably not need it. Yeah, Gonzalez is actually Captain HP. Uh, Rutger is mm -hmm. reasonably bulky to the point where I don't think he needs a rope. I think we might have... No, we didn't give him one, but he kind of... He could reasonably benefit from one, maybe. Roy already yeah. had one. He's pretty good as is. And then once I think he like, doesn't need one either. Yeah. Alan already got one. He's bulky enough as it is. So, I guess, Helen, if we want to grind lightning rank, it could be nice to get her a rope. But even with one rope, I think she's still too squishy. I don't want to give her two. Well, she has no speed. She's not getting doubled by stuff that much, right? So No. But it's like, I don't know. I think she doesn't even like take an extra hit from a lot of enemies when she has a rope. So I'd have to give her two, I think, to have her reasonably enemy phase stuff. You have and a point. This tome is also just bad. It's oh, like, yeah. Mm. No. I actually really enjoyed giving a rope to Larum once, just to make her like survive long range attacks, which is kind of funny. But I don't think I'm gonna do that which this time. Well, good for the boots dancer. We can put her into danger. Yeah, big benefit, right? That's true. Okay. Um, we should get Boyd to the seize point at some point. Let's see if I get a support yet. Get not the support yet. Uh, well, Roy is basically there anyway. He's just like move away and I'm block the spots with Rutger and Allen. We'll go from there. Exactly. Run away. That should work. I guess I'll get our Boots Dancer involved to speed up a little bit. All right. Don't let Rucker kill him, whatever. Whatever <laughs> you do. Right. Okay, run, Roy, run! Like, there's no way this goes wrong, right? Right? Mm. Right? Nah, no way, no way. Get the Risky Droppers ready. Uh, we, if I have our gem, yeah. I could sell it. I don't know where my gem is though. I traded on so many things just now. Then um, on Lin maybe. Lin is a gem, but oh, it's on it's on oh, pa. It's on pa. There it is. I, I think next time I'll just like yeah, just sell next time. Like, whatever. That's not worth the trouble. It's not worth the trouble. Just clean him out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> sell Douglas's silver axe as well. Yeah, oh, well, I guess not technically next map, but you know. Yeah, chapter. next up is the Guidance chapter, uh, 16x. That's right. The Heavenly Arrows. Raisins, prepare the Heavenly Arrows. The Heavenly Arrows? The RNG burning machine? Oh, they burn our ends? I thought they had to set locations where they go. No, uh, it was a joke about you burning oh, our ends with like the arrow. These yeah. arrows. Ah, yeah. I get it, <laughs> I get arrows. it. Sometimes yeah. you are too subtle for me, despite my. Superior intellect sometimes. Just kidding, I'm going on. A right. large cranium. We are ready to seize in turn 30. Let's just do it, right? This is, we got yeah. all the treasure. We got all the things. We got all the things here. Oh, I didn't kill the mage. mage. We're so it's bad, dude. Mage. Yeah, we're, we're losing yeah. out on like on. 20 XP here, but you know what? We can take that. It could have been, that could have been some Lin. That could have been a Lin clip. He's <laughs> <Not laughs> using a longbow to take that guy out. Mordred. Saints Tower. More like the Ain't Tower because we ain't go no I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, the prince. No, not the prince. He decided to hide his identity. What an original move for Fire Emblem Princes. That's true. Okay. Uh, it did What were we saying? Did an FE7 too. Yes. It always happens. It always happens. Anyhow, uh we are continuing this journey in chapter 16X. The Heavenly Arrows, or whatever it's called. Uh, the, the Tower of Lights, the Aureola Tower. The You Will Never Use This Thing Ever <laughs> Tower. Yeah, I know. But we'll do that next Have time. Have you ever cast that tome? I still haven't. Not since the last has been. <laughs> I've, I've never done it. See you guys next time. See you next time. <laughs>